Hey guys, Subsy Kid here with another tutorial on After Effects, and what I'm going to be showing you today is how to do an RGB split transition. There, uh, so it uses the Twitch plugin. So sorry if you don't have that, but it's not hard to get. So yeah, Google is your best friend. Yeah, um, I just did a quick example in like 20 seconds, and this is what it looks like. UAV standing by. So yeah, I think it looks pretty good. It's not the best because um, I just did it really quickly. But yeah, it's it looks pretty nice and it only uses three keyframes. That's it. A uh, three key three keyframes on the Twitch plugin, and that's like it on an adjustment layer. So yeah, let's get straight to it. So I'll just quickly delete that adjustment layer. So or we'll basically, I'll quickly show you what actually happened. So as you can see, it's just like normal. And if I go forward a frame, it just like it starts to get twitchy oh my god super twitchy and then boom it's just like while it see it's in the next clip you can't even realize it's like wow that's pretty nice so that's what i'm going to be showing you and it's pretty simple so i'll just uh, delete that adjustment layer so i can show you how to do it so create a new adjustment layer so layer new adjustment layer like that or you can see control alt y for keyboard shortcut masters so control alt y and then using the alt and bracket keys you can just chop down the adjustment layer to like that much because you don't need this massive thing going across the whole composition which just like which just like which just like makes your whole composition look really crap and we can just go ahead and rename this to like twitch transition like that so everything's nice and organized and named so uh yeah it's looking good it's like but it just looks kind of plain right now. So what you want to do is drag on the Twitch Twitch plugin and pop it onto your adjustment layer. And what you want to do is go onto behavior no not behavior enable and check slide and blur if you want to, or you can even like check all of them if you want. But I prefer just blur and slide sometimes light sometimes but I don't usually use that but as you can see blur and slide is what I use and I usually in the operator controls I just leave blur how it is and on slide you just turn up the slide RGB split so it's like however much you want really um, personal pref preference so let's if you just go forward and find a frame where it's like super twitchy so there you can just see how much it's gonna twitch so I would say 50 well that's for me and then basically go near to the end of the clip and find a frame which is super twitchy like super twitched so there uh, that's a good frame there and what you want to do is on the clip just hold down alt and then the square bracket like close square bracket and it'll close it'll cut the clip thing and then what you do is grab your other clip and drag it and hold down shift and it should just snap onto the timeline so it's just like boom that's basically the transition there if like as you can see but as you can see it's just like this whole thing's twitchy it's just like and it just kind of looks retarded so we just need to quickly keyframe it so find the center so just grab the timeline and hold shift and it should just snap there and on the twitch transition adjustment layer thingy click on that and then on the like global amount where it says 100% keyframe so hit the stopwatch make a keyframe 100% in the middle and then click on your adjustment layer here and hit U to bring up keyframes and then go for go backwards like two seconds one second however long you want it to like twitch in so the twitches is gonna like f fade in and then they're gonna fade out so I would say two seconds so that's two seconds for me and you make a keyframe and make it zero like that and as you can see it just goes it, it like twitch and it just the twitches get bigger and bigger and then as you can see it's just like twitching on but you want it to fade out so go to the middle keyframe and then go forward like two seconds a second maybe however much you want so I went one and a half seconds and what you do is just make it zero so 
boom, it's just like twitchy, twitching, twitching. Oh my god, super twitch transition, boom. And then it fades out. And what you can do is get the get the last keyframe and hit F9 and get the first keyframe and hit F9. That just makes them easy ease, so they'll just like ease in and ease out. Or if you have like dodgy function keys or like you're on a Mac and it doesn't really work for some reason, you can right click on them, keyframe assistant and easy ease like that. And boom, that's the transition. So let's quickly see how this came out. So yeah, that looks pretty nice. It just seems kind of weird because it's just like two clips just together and no music or anything. But yeah, that's basically it. Oh yeah, um, I just want to quickly say that these two clips are f are by the Devil Clan, and yeah, go subscribe to them because they're like super good clan. Um, I didn't have any other clips, and I was gonna do their recruitment challenge, so like I accidentally deleted all my other clips. So. Um, I thought I'd quickly use these, but I would shout out to them. So, yeah, go subscribe to Devil Clan. Pretty amazing. So, uh, yeah, that's about it. So it's like, yeah. Um, that's watching, guys. Hope this helped you. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, all that other stuff. Maybe a favorite if this helped you out and stuffs. And don't forget to write your tutorial requests in the comments below, or if you have any problems, just message me or something. So, yeah. See ya.